just kidding. Hi guys, it's Brig, aka Beauty by Oops. good okay anyways it's break aka video break, break aka the chick who makes a video once a year for some reason because she you know neglects her YouTube page I'm sorry I really do love making these videos I don't know what's wrong with me but anyways I have a video today don't really like how it turned out not at all really I'm very upset with the way it turned out but I'm sure you guys will appreciate me at least posting something um, now in the finished look there should be another piece right here but I jacked it up as I like squished my hand together trying to open something my own stupid fault so it's okay so this is actually based off of a makeup that I saw on Instagram by an artist his name is Pau Da Pau Da, Pau da? on Instagram, um, but his real name is Mark Clancy, and he does some amazing um, effects, like realistic, ama like honestly, like I just get like giddy whenever he posts something, and I try to find like a YouTube page or something, I don't think he has one, um, he's based in Australia, and like look at this, like look at this, like ah, how awesome, so look him up on Instagram, P-O-W-D-A-H. He's amazing and so inspirational um, for me because that's the kind of stuff I really enjoy doing. I'm not really, I don't know why my name is Beauty by Brig because I don't, I don't make beauty videos. Anyways, if you'd like to see how I did this little hickey majigger, uh, maggot popping out of my skin. Oh God, I'm really not happy with this. Anyways, if you want to see how I did it, just keep on watching and thank you. I don't know why I'm like yelling at you. I'm sorry. I don't mean to be. So first, let me tell you what you're gonna need, because <laughs> I always do, don't I? I do. I started with some spirit gum, laid it down where I was going to put the wax, tapped it with my finger until it was tacky and sticky. Then I took a piece of scar wax and as you can see on my wrist I'm keeping a blob of lotion because when you have lotion on your fingers it helps um, move the wax easier without it getting stuck to your finger and making a great big mess. So now I'm just getting it into the spot where I really want it to be and then I'm going to start smoothing out those edges, uh, first with just my finger and the lotion. And then here you can see I'm using just a flat tool, you can use like the back of a butter knife, whatever you use. And this is actually a nail daughter thing um, and you can use a pin, a paper clip, whatever. And then I just started making the dots and I put some lotion on the top of it so that the wax didn't stick to it too much. And you're just going to go all the way down through the wax to your hand and then just kind of make a little bit of a circular motion to open up the hole a bit. And as you can see, this is with all the wax all holy and whatnot. And now I'm just taking some fake blood on a little baby paintbrush and going in each individual little hole, socket thing, little egg hole for the maggot to come out of. And then now, because I want some of them to be kind of darker, the ones that are deeper, so I took a deep purple cream makeup and you can use whatever you have um, and I just use the same brush and dab that in there as well. And now I'm just taking some more fake blood and filling up some of those little pockets. And as you can see, I added two more parts of it. Um, I like that a lot better than this, but I kind of jacked up the one piece, so I had to take it off because I was being frustrated. Um, and this is actually a blob of liquid latex that I put down when I started. 
Um, and since the edges are dried, um, I'm peeling that up, and that's what I use to make my little maggot worms out of. Um, you're just going to take a piece of that. Uh, latex will stick to itself pretty easily, so just roll it up and then cut it into pieces that you want and you can just stick it inside of your little little egg sack thingies so there they are little nuggets coming out um and that's the finished look as always thank you for watching and i hope you liked it even though i didn't um comment rate subscribe it's been a while i don't remember exactly what you do on youtube anymore <laughs>